Hey guys, John Luxa here. Just wanted to take a moment to tell you guys about uh, the Internet Archive. If you haven't heard about it, most people, most people probably have, but I'm not sure people are aware what is available. So if you go to https slash or colon slash slash archive dot org, if you you know Google or Bing or or do any other kind of search for Internet Ar Archive, it'll pull up this website. What is important is all the games that it has on it. This is a gaming channel, and we do play a lot of games. And those of you that are interested in free games that maybe don't have a lot of money or income or other stuff, uh, this is actually a great place to play some older, you know, MS DOS games and other stuff. So we'll go to the, uh, you can see my cursor right here. Go to the software. You have the Internet Arcade, which is like, well, let's click on it. You have all these old, old games. And you can either download them, or I believe you can play them right through the console or through your, your browser itself, uh, like Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom right here. But recently, at least recently as of the uh, recording of this video, there is, uh, hmm, well, that, I want to go back to this, all software. They, uh, they just did this, the MS-DOS software library with, 19,091 titles on it. So you can click here. They just updated this to include, I don't even know how many more games, but you have stuff like the Oregon Trail, the original Prince of Persian, Pac-Man, Disney's Aladdin, you know, like a lot of different different things. Uh, let's Batman Returns, okay. All sorts of different ones. Golden Axe, for example, from Sega. You click on this. And uh, click to begin. Launching the emulator. Oh, we have to uh, have fun. Uh, I guess we'll do four for VGA. We want 256 colors instead of 16. There you go. There's your, uh, there's your golden axe playing right through the monitor. There's controls up in the upper right that are hidden by my camera. But there you go, you can make it full screen. The, uh, the sound should actually be muted, but it's not. So there's probably a little bit of an echo there, if so I do apologize. But Centurion, Defender of Rome. All kinds of crazy and unique and interesting games. Free to play at your fingertips as long as you have an internet connection. So that's, that's basically it. I just wanted to make a free video or a free video, a quick video, just showing you guys all the different stuff that's available. Um, there's there's tons of games. There's tons of games out there, especially that are that are lost to time, and uh, maybe just unavailable, or people don't want to take the time to to get to work on their computer. You know, I'm honestly not sure if these will work through a phone. It is something to give a try. I mean, maybe. Probably not, but you could try it. There are there are other options, right? So, but that's it for today. I just wanted to want to tell you guys about this. If you're unaware, and and if you are aware, check it out. If you're not aware, also check it out. It's like look at this, the original Wolfenstein 3D. How cool is that? It's amazing. Mario teaches typing. There you go. Uh, but yeah, all, all sorts of free games, especially if you're on a budget or you just want to try something a little bit more different. Anyway, I thought I'd share it with you guys. I'm sure many of you are already aware, but if you're not, there you go. Anyway, that's all for today. Uh, I hope to see you guys next time. Till then, guys, take care.